So I want to do a draw this again for this picture. So from one I remember this dates back to 2015. It was the year when I first started playing with watercolors and there's a lot of things wrong with it. The head is way too big for the body. It is insanely big. The face is too small for the head, but still too big for the body. It's just all the proportions are askew and weird. It's like a bobble head. Today we're going to try and recreate it and make it bit, hopefully. So first we're going to start with the sketch. And I still struggle with making heads appropriate size. They still turn out bigger than they're supposed to. But not as bad as they used to be. So let's just sketch it out a little. I don't know, is that arm too long? What do you think? I don't know anymore. Oh, this is a disaster. <laughs> I think we should try again. So let's do the sketch again. I haven't been, I haven't, I'm a little rusty, I guess. Just because I haven't really done much painting lately. That's why I skipped um, last week upload. This life has been a little crazy. My partner got in a car accident. So that's been concerning. Um, a bunch of other things happened. Like my tooth broke. And uh, yeah, it's been it's been it's been a hectic, hectic couple weeks. It's been crazy. Preferences change a lot, man. Like in my head, my style didn't change that much since 2015, but now looking at it, like I look, I, I paint and I draw completely different. And that's crazy because I thought that like I, it's been about the same. <laughs> now let's try again. <laughs> What's the saying? If at first you don't succeed, succeed try and try again. <laughs> now we're gonna do just that. Uh, let's do it again. Let's try again. This is me when I am struggling art-wise. I just haven't had a very good couple weeks. I think we're gonna make it more focused on the face like it is in the picture, in the original picture, because it's a lot more focused on the face rather than the full figure that I was trying, trying to do or whatever. And um, so let's just make it a little more like a hot body or like a bust. I don't know why I'm struggling so bad. Oh, burnout. How do you guys deal with burnout? I usually try to wait a little bit and then just and then try to like fulfill myself creatively in a different way. So I was making jewelry. Yeah, but it's been going on for too long for my liking now. You can see how like scratchy my sketches because I'm very unsure what I'm putting down. And you see the head is like turned out way too big again. Should be like this size, I think. I also, I, th I feel like it's a bad habit of starting to def detail face before I like finish the rest of the composition because I jump into one thing and then I focus on it super hard and then I, and then everything else kind of goes skew. This sucks. <laughs> So where do I want to put the hand? Because I understand that like if she, if she had her hand, like, her arms crossed, you wouldn't really see the rest of the arm. But 
I just don't like how it looks like. The longer I look at it, the more like, the less I like it. I feel like something is way off. How about that? I think that, that would be, I don't, I don't know anymore. Do you know that chart? I'll pop it on the screen. Do you know that chart of like, when you don't like anything you do, that means that your perception evolved and your skill didn't? So you will need time for your skill to catch up with your perception. And uh, I don't know if that's what's going on right now, but it is very frustrating. It's getting more and more different the longer I tinker with it. I don't like this arm anymore. <laughs> so, <laughs> my camera overheated. <laughs> and um, I tinkered with the sketch for a little while off camera. And I think I came to something I can I can accept. I cleaned it up a little bit and now we will see if I will mess it up with the painting <laughs> or not. So let's try yet again. The paper doesn't really want to um, take on the paint because I I done goofed and overworked it with the eraser because I've been tinkering with it for so long. Everything looks like dirt. <laughs> I don't know how much longer fiddling with this paper can take. I think I'll stop here because I'm just gonna keep going and going and going. It's already looking like a mess. I said as I'm keeping fiddling with it. I never know when to stop. Oh, this paper just doesn't want to take any more paint on it. It's like, please, no, no. Okay, so this is where we're at at the moment, and I think I'm gonna add the little trees in the background with the ink wash. I have a little Pentel aqua brush filled with the India ink and water and I'm just gonna Let me know what you think. I definitely think the anatomy on the new one is better, but the coloring, I'm not a big fan. It turned out a little muddy. But overall, not too bad, I guess. So I wanted to thank you guys because we just recently hit a hundred subscriber. Thank you so much. Still, let me know if you want to do something for a hundred subscribers, like a digital art commission giveaway or something like this just leave me a comment and we'll figure something out thank you i'll see you next week bye